By the time General Homer's victorious troops crossed Manila's Pasig River, the Japanese had mapped out every major building in the city and knew exactly what they wanted to do with them. Among the institutions marked for occupation was the Dominican Academy, Santa Tomas University. It was founded in 1611 by Spanish Dominican priests. The college sits on a 60-acre rectangle block, north of the port area. It is enclosed with a 12-foot concrete and stone wall. Santo Tomas closed its doors in early 1941, during the first weeks of bombings. In January 1942, a Japanese platoon of soldiers took possession of the abandoned campus and rounded up all foreign civilians working and living in Manila and brought them here. Initially, the conditions at Santo Tomas were not exceptionally harsh. However, they deteriorated rapidly after the prison was transferred from the control of Japanese civilians to the Japanese military in February 1944. By the end of the year, many prisoners were dying each month from starvation, and there were threats of execution. advanced south and east, the fighting often bloody. But General MacArthur, eager to retake Manila, pushed his commanders to pick up pace. Go to Manila, he told the commander of the 1st Cavalry Division. Free the internees and Santa Tomas. February 3, 1945, the 1st Cavalry Division liberated Santa Tomas internment camp. 